feel so awkward. <laughs> Wait, the cowboy just scared me. <laughs> Welcome to today's vlog. Today is a rainy day. It's also our first day at level two. If you want to see this is an example of good leadership, we have three cases of COVID as of yesterday. So the region they're in is currently in lockdown mm, as of last night. Day. But like we're not in that day. region. So we're just in level two, which means not much really. Wait. But <coughs> Sorry. So we've got a few jobs to do. The girls, we was no second night last night. Did you bring the list? Yeah, it's in my bag. Good. Let me just the list. We have a list. Should of I read the list out? We're going to shopping. Got shopping the list. Today. You write them. Oh my gosh, you've got like three different sections. I love it. Four different sections. This one. All right. So this is our route. College hall. The dress place. I have some dresses I need to drop off. The dump for the cardboard. The warehouse came out. Countdown. And then maybe the gym. All right. Well, anyway, <laughs> let's go to college hall and visit Liam. Woohoo! Yay! Okay, guys. We went to drop off that little letter to Liam. And this letter for the person who's moving into my room that I had in uni last year, the halls. And apparently they've like named who it is, but they wouldn't tell us because like privacy reasons. But I Fair saw her and she has blonde. I mean brown, brown hair. hair. We saw she has brown. And then there's hair. a girl next to her that, that has brown hair, and I reckon they're gonna become. They're gonna best be friends. friends, just like we were. Yeah. Sweet, like we are. Then we went to the dump station to drop off our rubbish, and as you can see, the rubbish is still still on the car because they mm. don't take rubbish like recycling. <laughs> so now we have to go to a different place to drop that off. But I need to drop off these, which is the dresses that I you would have seen on my Instagram that I wore to a couple of events in the weekend. So I'm going to take these and drop them back. We're outside the house now. So I'm going to drop these back. So if you want to check out this rental place, it's renting with SB. I'm an ambassador for them now. I'll leave this running. You guys can talk to the camera. Oh, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's tell her secrets. We'll make a new clip. Hello. What's up? We should sing. I'm in. Come on, drive us <laughs> Guys, it's Emma's flatmates right now. Yeah, hi. Um, We're here to tell you guys a secret about Emma. Quick, she's coming back. She uh, hates. Guys, look. There's no rubbish in the back anymore. So we managed to find the dump station after making a few phone calls. Like, wait, no, seven. I'm saying dump station is rubbish station. Dump station is where you take your <laughs> you in your camper van. Rubbish it's dump. Rubbish though. dump. That's the one. But anyway, we're at the base now to make a warehouse. All right, we need a mirror. A mirror for the entrance way. An ironing board because we don't have an, we have an iron but not the board. A fake plant, a fake maybe? plant, and a shower, some shower I need gel. Some shower gel. Wait, fake plant for where? For the front. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Are yeah. we getting mirror, mirror, yeah. ironing, board. ironing board, bin, bucket, extension cord, another bin, body frame, body wash, body wash and with people in masks and I don't know how to feel about it because <laughs> it feels like deja vu. Sorry, I feel like whenever I film I have really bad angles. Okay, bye bye. Back in the yeah. house. But yeah, we bought a photo frame to go, like, when you'll see the house tour, Rachel and I's rooms, like, we have our own little hallway, so we're gonna get, like, one of you guys actually. She made, like, a, a painting of, of us. us, so we're gonna print that out and chuck it in the photo. So frame. that painting is gonna go into our house. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, yeah. Oh my god, I didn't know we were on camera, I'm paying no attention. <laughs> I promise you I pay attention all the time. That's good that she can tell that we're not putting on different voice. Yeah, that's actually true, yeah. Wow, that's a test right there. Wait, she didn't think we were having a conversation. <laughs> okay, let's go to camera! Woohoo, favorite place! Also guys, I got this drink bottle over there on my house and garden show. It's really cute, got little flowers on it, but it's from Ryman's. Which they, is like a retirement village. Alright, let's go to Kmart. Oh, it wants me to confirm it. Can I film the total so far <laughs> oh hit the 70s um, we have the you could catch in this spending too much money on flat stuff. Literally. Yeah, as you can see, everything including the family family value pack of toilet paper. Literally have so much stuff. We really I bought like lunch. I bought a dinner for like two weeks. We really oh. uncovered. And it like, cost me thirty seven dollars. We've really uncovered like who uses the most toilet paper. We had a discussion about how many squares we use. Yeah. Also, I think question, we all use the same. Question, are we fold or scrunch people? Oh, 100% scrunch. Who scrunch. has time to fold? Fold. <laughs> I knew you were a fold person. You are such a fold person. Are you <laughs> You said you're unboxing. So Rachel's actually tuned into a YouTuber. I'm um, unboxing uh, uh, toast baby machine. So we're currently eating lunch. I have look some how beautiful. Food. Oh my gosh, don't damage the bench top. I have some chicken tortellini with some cabanara sauce. Okay, 
I've had my lunch, which you may have seen that little clip where Morgan was. Yeah, Flying if you decide to put that in. Look at these. They look fantastic. I have an ungodly amount of tomato sauce. That is like too much. Actually, actually, that's not that are they little spinach sauce. and fit a little like the, vegetarian sausage rolls? Yeah, it's literally little like vegetarian filled with spinach and feta. They look really nice. Because she is vegetarian or yeah. well, not vegetarian, but like pescatarian. When we got back from our little trip at the front door before Morgan set the alarm off. Well, I have two packages here that were listening at the door when we got back. I know what both of them are, so we're gonna open them. The first one is from Douglas Pharmaceuticals, so I used to unbox these boxes for a job when I used to work at the pharmacy. But they actually messaged me and like, hey, would you want to like try out some of our products and like I already use them. Like, so, little clinician's box. <gasps> so Sleep Science, which is obviously to help with the sleep. B, yeah, B complex, which is vitamin B, oh, which is help with, that. yeah, same. I literally have this exact one in the pantry already. So I've got one in my So this one's to help with like fatigue, moodiness, um, stress, irritability. And then this one, stress and energy support, which is for stress, low energy, and when you're feeling burnt out. So, very excited about these. Thank you, clinicians. I was gonna say I'm really excited to try them, but like I already have, so. Now this next one, it's very exciting. It was Valentine's Day yesterday, and this is actually Owen's Valentine's Day present, but I did not purchase this. This was gifted to me by the company, which I'm about to show you. He has no idea, but I didn't tell him what it was. Bro, when are you gonna give it to him? I wanna get it to him this afternoon, so I'll give it to him then. Can you get on camera? Yeah, I'll try to, because I need well, to do no, something yeah, like for the brand. Yeah. Nord Green. So if you don't know what Nord Green is, that's where this bad boy is from, which was also gifted to me. So they're a very generous company. They are based out of Copenhagen. So I'm just gonna open this and show you guys. I'm actually really excited. Oh my goodness. That is insane. Do you guys see this? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm just putting it out there. He's gonna love this. Wait, no. That is so good. I don't wanna like fully take it out because I want him to do that, but. Oh my goodness. Okay. Rachel. Rachel, come see this. What? It's Owen's Valentine's present. Don't go into the toilet. We're currently cleaning the house because we have a visitor coming over. And look, we framed it. Sorry, we'll get it. We'll get no, all this more. Because their room is like next to each other. And yeah, we're gonna put it next to our room. So we're cleaning the house, and then, and then we're gonna make sushi. My friend. Oh yeah, we're gonna make sushi. Okay. We can't show you the house yet because. <gasps> Wait, she's here. Okay, so our first visitor came. My friend Grace. Hello, Grace. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is Grace. Three oh from facts about yourself. Three from facts about myself. Yeah. I babysat a kid the other day and they knew you. But they and actually... she was like, why aren't you in her vlog? Two more fun facts. She's, She's got a really sweet boyfriend. Yeah, he's good. And oh, I, I once fed my sister cat food. But do you like the house? It's beautiful. We cleaned it up for you. Grace goes to church with us as well, guys. Yeah, she goes to a rise church. So if you want to come to a rise church and meet us Grace. Three. Come and meet Grace at a right church. Or at my work. <laughs> Alright guys, currently wrapping up this present. Owen's probably going to be here shortly. It's 20 past 4. I'm very excited to see his reaction because he has no idea. I told him, I gave him his Valentine's Day present yesterday for Valentine's Day, which I just gave him one of those world maps where you can like scratch off where you've been so when we can actually go places we can start scratching off where we've been together. And then I got him a notebook and a pen because he started coaching football so it's like one he can use for that or he can use it for whatever he wants. But he, I told him, like when we're, we always, like when we it's a gift buying situation we always set ourselves a budget that like it's fair on each other and I said I have a gift coming for you from a brand but obviously I didn't pay for that myself so I'm happy to not worry about that and we'll just send budget for our own gifts so that's what we did so he bought me a gift I bought him a gift and then this is like an extra thing for him I'm very excited to give it to him because he has no idea what it is it's been really hard for me to keep the secret eh yeah literally like because like I've been emailing this brand to try and sort it out Nord Green and they're amazing to work with absolutely incredible company to work with the amount of times I've said to Owen like nearly said because I always tell him when I get a brand I always tell him because I'm so excited to like work with these companies and to not tell him that this has been really hard. Like, it's not like I've had to lie and be like, oh no, like nothing's happening, which has made it easier. Yeah. But just to keep my mouth shut. Yeah. <laughs> That's been hard. Also, should we tell them what we're doing tonight? Mm, girls night in, me, Morgax and Rachel. Oh, we're making gross, but... sushi and watching The Bachelor. Take a seat. This is bouncing top of my head, <laughs> guys. Hopefully it doesn't fall. Here is your present. Do you have any ideas what it is? I guessed the last one, but I can't guess this. This is... He guessed the world map that I got him, guys. He like opened it and he's like, oh, is this like a world map? The one of the ones you scratch? Oh, you have to... Maybe. It's kitty locked. Yeah. I'll just play with the hot wheel. Yeah. Boop. It's cool, bro. Thank you. 
Hey guys, what's up? Time to make some dinner. We're currently cooking rice and cooking some chicken. And then we're gonna make some sushi. We're gonna make some sushi. These guys never made sushi before, so I'm gonna teach them because I pride myself on my two weeks I spent in Japan when I was 12 years old. <laughs> My sushi, Rachel's sushi. We, we won't we we won't show you Morgan's sushi. And the bachelor ba bach bachelorette. Bachelorette. Of New Zealand. Of New Zealand. Also fun fact, one of my brother's friends is related to Lexi. Like cousins. Really? So uh now you know. Hello guys, it is now Friday and this what did we film on Monday? Is that Monday? Yeah. Yeah. I've just finished editing the video so I can upload it and get it out for you guys for tomorrow. If you made it this far in the video, please comment a little sushi emoji so that we know that you made it this far and know that we made sushi for dinner, which tasted amazing. It was pretty good, eh? It was pretty good. Also, congratulations to New Zealand. We I said at the start of the video how Auckland was in lockdown because of those three cases. They are now on level two. Things are getting better. They're getting to the bottom of it. Love good leadership from Jacinda. We but love yeah. Auntie Cindy. We do. And also, wanted to make a little shout out to everyone because I know there's a lot of people moving away from home at the moment to unis and stuff. So, honestly guys, that's how we met. We yeah. were in your guys' shoes literally a year ago, pretty much today. Like so, we met a year ago. Yeah. Like this weekend. Yeah, crazy. So if you're That could there, be you, meeting your best friend. Literally. Just our advice, I've had a few people asking me like for advice. Our advice would be leave your doors open so when people walk past you can like say hey, make conversation. And obviously classes haven't started yet. I think Wellington start this week, next week, okay. Yeah. But in your classes, be friendly, be yourself. And uni's cool because it's a really diverse range of people. So you'll find someone who's just like you. But yeah, apart from that, stay safe, stay well, make someone smile. And we'll see you in my next video. Bye. Stuck in places that shouldn't get stuck. No. Fruit in the fruit bowl. And Brian, we have vlogger. And then and then there's lots of food in the fridge. Fridge tour. Bye. <laughs> What's her name? <laughs> <laughs> there's no COVID cases in New Zealand. Other than yesterday.